Hey everybody, I'm Schmirkadaber, and welcome back to the Adventures of Gary here on The Witcher 3. I've got some guy just randomly talking as he walks past, ruining my intro. Gary, are you going to stand for that? Yeah, you probably are. Um, we're still looking for, uh, for old Dandelion, and that has led us to uh, consult with Zoltan again here. Zoltan, you old bum. What's this? Haven't even drunk her water? Naughty bound. Now repeat. Savory crackers. Are you gonna say it? Owl? No, it's an owl, Zoltan. It's not gonna talk to you, dude. Well, let's have a chat about something else. If you could uh, pull yourself away from your best friend here, uh, it would be much appreciated. Ah, back. You met Poppy? She ought to stop talking any day now. Um, she's an owl, not a parrot. That's Zoltan, exactly what I was saying. Venture to say a mage would have trouble turning that owl into a parrot. Sure, you know me that well. Mark my words, she'll be playing Gwent Brothers in no time. But we were to talk about Dandelion. Yeah, we were. We'll so, come back and, and play you Gwent do? with your owl, Learn dude. Much? We'll do that at some other point. Um, I think I got something. Women on my list hadn't seen Dandelion in a while. All claimed he had been acting strange. Also mentioned he'd been seeing someone else. Thing is, Mystery Woman wasn't on my list. What's she supposedly like, this lass? Blonde, from Kovir. A Troberitz, apparently, named Kalanetta or something like that. <laughs> that makes it clear as crystal. It's Priscilla. Aye. Must be her. Uh, who's Priscilla? Who's this Priscilla? A Troberitz, like you said. Quite popular of late. Picks up dandelion with a pair of tits and you've got the <laughs> Interesting image. So how dandelion handled meeting his female double? I think he fell Sexually, in love. Sexually, I'm sure. Uh, that's big news, man. What can I say? Could be he finally met his match. She's his match, all right. Maybe more. Is the dandelion finally going to settle down? He's got him whirling. All right. Find out today on the to Adventures her. of Gary. Priscilla works for the Mummers troop. Reynard and the Foxen. Whenever they're in town, she performs nightly at <laughs> You were prepared! I mean we've been sentenced to an evening of poetry. It's a very pixelated looking prince. This'll be true poetry, Geralt. You'll see. Oh good! Time for a poetry slam! Oh, that's exciting, actually. I'm kind of excited about that. Okay. After sundown. Well, it's already 7.14 p.m., so that's pretty cool. Uh, we should just be able to head straight there. And, uh, oh, and get this shiz going. So, Gary, let's go. Let's sprint, in fact. Let's just go running as fast as we possibly can through town so that nobody thinks that we're up to anything. All right. Kingfisher Inn. There's lots of little inns in this town, and I really, really like that. Like, this feels like a legitimate lived-in city, and that's really, really cool. Like, I, I feel like... I honestly I have no clue where I am right Any now. Last words. Horson's henchmen. Uh this fool is going down so fast. And this guy in his underwear is also going down so fast. Good? You okay, lady? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. All right. No, uh, I don't want to be your boyfriend. I simply want to kill bad guys, uh, kiddos. So I don't know. I'd say come see me in like 20 years, but I don't think that's the best plan either. Hey, a drunk. Okay, we're here at the Kingfisher. It's 7:33 p.m. The sun isn't quite down yet, per se. Where does this go? Oh, it's locked. All right. Well, let's go in. And, uh, and see what the deal is. Hey, look at this. We're good. We're good to go. I guess that 7.30 p.m. does count as after sundown. That's nice. Oh, I can't get over how good Gary looks, man. He just looks so good. Uh, He's gonna already. pick up some, some sweet on, meats some at, the, uh, at the inn some here, I'm soon. sure of it. Maybe the entire poetry slam troupe. Uh, starting with her and her awesome leggings... Oh, man. I'm excited. And it's climbing the stairway to heaven. Yeah, make sure to tune it up. It's drop D. Put it in drop D. Yep. 
Oh, yeah, that's important, too. Gotta have the right foot position. This guy's already into it. He's like, do you see how fucking good this is? You don't even understand how good it is. Gary even looks pretty happy about it. Yeah, that guy in the background is joking around, though. We don't appreciate that. You gotta respect your performers. These scars long have yearned for your tender caress To bind our fortunes Damn what the stars on Rend my heart open Then your love profess A winding weaving fate to which we both atone You flee my dream come Scent, berry star, lilac sweet To dream of raven locks and twisted stormy Of violet eyes glistening as you weep The wolf I will follow into the storm To find your heart it's That's the King of Beggars, right? Even he's into it. By our ever growing, hardening into stone, amidst the cold to hold you in a heated embrace, you flee. My dream come the morning. Your scent berries tart, lilac sweet. To dream. Gary's like, wait a minute. This is like straight up about me right now. Oh, yeah. It's really getting to everybody. Again, except that guy in the background. Dicking around back there. Have us live as one. Or if by love's blind chance we've been bound. The wish I whispered when it all began. Did it forge a love you might never have found? You flee. Ugh, my she's dream looking. Is she looking at Gary again? No. We're, this girl is just repeating what she. Oh, holy shit, dude. To dream of raven locks and twisted stormy of violet eyes. <laughs> This, uh, I don't know. This could have been shorter. King of Beggars is like, all right. Yep, she's just repeating herself now. So I'm just going to be off on my way. This is uh, the Plain White Tees, right? Like, that's who this is by? I'm pretty sure. I I'm pretty pretty certain that's the case. And one guy. Yay! Okay, now everybody else is clapping. The, uh, I gotta say, this inn here has some pretty freaking serious acoustics. Like, a Gary's half-hearted clap. Hey, that's a witcher! That looked like fucking... I know him! Whoa. Twas him murdered some Temerian boys back in White Orchard. Yeah. Silence, woman. We've come to hear music. A murderer? There's a war on. Some die. Oh, please, argue this out elsewhere. Nice, let's have a fight. It's very Stop important that we have a fight now. Again. And I was told this was a decent establishment. If I know Geralt, he risked his noggin to save someone else's arse. <laughs> save, you say? He murdered folk. I did kill a lot of people in White Orchard. Don't let him provoke you. There's the door. Settle this outside. Come. Yeah, see? I got a backstage patch, bitch. How do you like music. that? Music. Cultural capital of the world? The fuck it is. Wow, these people just heard a song that literally brought them to tears and now they're already complaining about the culture in this city. To introduce like Jesus. Uh, this year's Priscilla, known also as Caladetta. As lovely as she is talented. And this is Geralt of Rivia, I know. 
Dandelions told me a great deal about you, and I've listened with bated breath. Yeah, Don't see, be surprised. After she all, already Dad, wrote a song a about me. Subject for a ballad than a witch's love for a sorceress. Yeah, of course. Or should I say, sorceress? Oh, Gary. Seems Dandelion left nothing out. Seems Dandelion was meticulous in telling my story, down to personal and insignificant details. Did he offer anything about himself, like where he was going? <laughs> nice, Gary. Nice. <laughs> Splendid. Very funny, truly. So, see you later. <laughs> Come with me. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Man, the voice acting in this game is pretty there good. For all this sneaking around. An excellent one. When last I saw Dandelion, he told me he was planning a heist. Siggy Reuven's vault. She oh shit. And I've not seen him since. Time for a heist, everybody. Take it the heist was a bust? Let me guess. Attempted heist was a Maybe failure. he hasn't tried well, yet. But he's not driven up in a gilded carriage laden with yeah. jewels, so I should think so. I've asked after him everywhere. But it seems an army of tongue-stealing cats has overrun the city. I learned only that he raised a ruckus at Horson Jr.'s lair. Then Horson's men chased him all over town. Horson Jr. Doesn't ring a bell. I just, you just killed two of his men. Norigrad. You didn't see yeah, Horson's literally. thug or Horson thug above their heads, Gary? A fan, but what did he do to you? Try the whole town. He's one of he the cut off half of my legs. Underworld. The others being Siggy Reuven, Carlo the Cleaver Veres, and the King of Beggars. The rascal. At least they didn't cross the church as well. Bring that venerable institution into it. We'd be in deep then. Uh, looks like I got a rescue dandelion again. Go again. Rushing to dandelion's rescue. He ought to pay me a salary. Wherever he is, I sincerely doubt he's in the mood for jokes. Nor am I. I mean, it kind of sounds Relax. like he's always in the mood for jokes. Gotta talk to this horse in first. And Siggy Reuven. Know where I might find them? I don't know about Horson, but Reuven runs a bathhouse. Oh, bathhouse time. He's a dangerous yes. character. All right, so Gary, it's time to get clean. You haven't had a bath in it. too long. The dandelion's not. I beg you to hurry. Let me know as soon as you learn anything. All right. You got it, Priscilla. Um, well, would you like to sleep together? To That's the thing that I do with people, Head right? To the no? Okay, I see you have a bath here. Are you, are you going to take a bath, Priscilla? No? I'm sorry, Dwarf. I wasn't listening. I was thinking about Priscilla taking all of her clothes off. Um, so, Priscilla... <laughs> Yeah. Uh, see ya. Take care now. All right, bye. I'm I'm taking this water. I need it. Uh, it's oh Jesus, there she is. Wow, she just like vanished. Um, yes, I'm commandeering uh, this water, this dumpling, and this dried fruit. It's necessary to my mission uh, to rescue Dandelion. I will also uh, now. I don't need that book, but um, but I do need this book. Yes! Have I read this one yet? Uh, oh, it's about griffins. I already know enough about griffins. Okay, goodbye forever. Um, how do I get back downstairs? I need to get to the bathhouse and talk to Siggy Reuven. Uh, and uh, to have a nice spa day. I'm gonna get my nails did. Um, I'm gonna, well, I, I just got my hair did. I mean, really, this going to the spa is much more of a, uh, out of the way, lady. It's, uh, it's much more of a status thing. It's really so people can see me there, not so I can actually use the place. Um, so yeah, the, I'll have them, I'll, I'll get a mani-pedi while I'm there, and people will be like, holy shit, did you see Gary's latest haircut? And, and oh my god, I'm standing in fire. <laughs> That was so dumb. Praise my will to live. All right. I think we found it, at least. Let's knock. Anybody there? Open up. I'm here for a Manny Petty, and I want it now. I'll pay you twice the normal rate. Just kick it in, Gary. Fucking get in there, man. What's the fuss? The bathhouse is closed. Need to talk to the owner. I know he's here. I'm not sure that matters, as he's terribly busy. Uh, don't care. Tell him Geralt of Rivia wants to talk to him. I cannot promise Mr. Reuben we'll have time to see you. Wanna bet? <laughs> Damn, Gary. <laughs> I shall try. Please wait. <laughs> 
All right. Bathhouse time. It's going to be a personal bathhouse experience from the owner himself. Whoa, look at City your Rudy freaking gullet, dude. You to join him. I'm happen. Happen. Okay, well happen. Um, you're... The meeting is in you, the baths. You definitely we look like the little the troll so or, or, or something of some kind. You're disgusting looking, is what I'm saying. Uh, pardon me while I uh, physically intimidate your boss. Uh, your look at this. No your equipment will be safe. Uh, I can't have my equipment, huh? Um, okay, where where do, do do I go in? Is that that's the outside door? Okay, where does this go? Can I go through here? No, of course I can't. It's locked. Get undressed. Oh shit, we are gonna have a bathing experience. This is amazing. Okay, let's put our clothes away. Aw oh, yeah, Gary. See, people are gonna see you here. They're gonna be like, damn, Gary's looking good. Ladies, oh, there's boobs. Okay, well, prepare for censorship, ladies and gentlemen. You were right. He doesn't blush. I don't blush, indeed. Uh, courtesans. You Damn. Got you got a pie. This is crazy. Holy crap. I don't need this stuff. Where's the Where's the guy I'm supposed to talk to here? Okay, there he is. Out of the way, jerk. I got things to do. I got doors to open. The dwarf is already here too. Uh, what was his name? Orson Junior is a dead man. I'll have my. Oh no, you're a different dwarf. Notice. You don't have a scribe, and we'll eliminate Junior when and only when all of us say I. Hi guys. Your guest. I'm Gary. I'm here to um, admire your Why tattoos. The fuck you let him in here. Because I want to talk to him. This is Geralt of Rivia. Good to see you again. Do I know you? Is that the the, the the king of you? beggars? Um, none of your business. None of your business. Your friend got a death wish. <laughs> no, just short on manners, which is aren't exactly the sophisticated urban types. Got intruders. Someone just snuck inside the bathhouse. Several men. What the fuck's he on about? Plowing fortune teller. Assassins! Oh no, assassins! Please, no! Am I gonna have to punch? Oh shit, dude! Bloody hell! I fucking knew it. I'm gonna have Any to punch some away? people. Just a few. Oh nice. Okay. Give me something good. I want something nice. I get a club. Okay, that's fine. That's a good choice, Gary. That's uh, maximum pain bringing to potential assassins. Um, okay, we're fighting people in the nude, indeed. This is kind of exciting. <laughs> You're on fire! That was awesome. You're done. You're done. And um, I'd like to uh, switch to Axie, please. I didn't want to light people on fire. I didn't want to torch people. All right. Uh, do I? Oh, okay. I still don't have enough. We need one alive. Whatever. Bam. We need one alive, you say? Oh. Get Junior. Um, I could have mind controlled one, but. Good work, gents. Did we? Did we keep one Terribly alive? I'm sorry for that incident. My security failed. I'll get to the bottom of who, why, and how. They were horse son scum. That's the bottom of who and how right there. Don't start that again. Especially not in front of our guest. Well, tell me about this horse son. Who pranced in right before they attacked. Coincidence? Why do I doubt it? Let's give him a chance to explain. I'm Gary. <laughs> um, I need to see him. I'm looking for Horson Jr. Interesting. What do you want with him? Um, it's a personal matter. It's personal. <laughs> uh, Geralt takes his privacy very seriously. 
Spying on him, having him followed, was a bloody nightmare. Still, <laughs> he was lots more trusting when he was looking for Marigold. Gentlemen, you out of your fucking minds? A chat session? Poor son's out to get us, and he'll succeed eventually. We've got to kill him first. So by all means, you sit here, soak, fart, and watch the bubbles rise, while I send my boys to Horse Sun's hidey holes. They'll make some noise, flush the bugger out. And you, Geriatric, or whatever your plowing name is, Gary. wanna find Horse Sun? Find me first. Geriatric, thank you very much. Um, okay, so where am I gonna find him? Any clue on Junior's whereabouts? Be grateful for any lead. Siggy, it's worth a try. Geralt's got a knack for finding people, and he's discreet, a value in itself. I am. Nobody ever sees what Leave I'm doing around again. town. It's I'll, not like uh, I run over them with horses you tomorrow, and shit. Francis. Finish our talk. So how about we get dressed? Sure, sure. Then we'll talk in private. All right. More talking. Hooray. Right mess that was. Never thought I'd be glad to see the man responsible for my taking frequent baths. If you're any cleaner for it, gotta say it was worth breaking your ankle. It healed poorly. Can you believe it? I must soak it in hot water at least six times a day now. Failing that, it bloody pounds like the bells of Beauclair at dawn. I don't know who you are and why I did that, but I had my reasons. I had my reasons. Your leg would be fine if you hadn't gotten in my way. I see. Well, I promise you that if I could go back in time, I'd do things quite differently on Thanid. For example, I'd have my men kill you instead of just tying you up. Listen, Reuven. No, Dijkstra. Just not in the mood for your code names, passwords, and other bullshit. I'm here on specific business. If you want to listen, listen. If not, I'd rather you spared me your wit and threw me out now. Ah, uh, what's the harm? Talk. Think Cleaver will find Orson? He might. He might not. But he'll burn down half the city trying. What waste. Leave him to it, I say. Work alone. All right. Any ideas? Cool. Junior's got areas of the city where he's strong. Penetrate them, look around. But be discreet. None of this speed and fury and swinging your steel cock about. But why have a steel cock if you can't swing it about? All right, where is he strong? Where do I Makes need to go? Sense to ask around, I guess. Junior might be in hiding, but he's got to be collecting income. Couldn't afford to cut himself off. Gambling. That's his big earner. Junior controls the largest casino in town. I'll never forget. Hierarch Hemelfart raised all kinds of hallowed hell there was. Is that his real name? Lost his ruby ring. Hierarch Hemelfart? Then there's the arena in the city's bowels. Betting scheme generates near as much as the casino. They're always looking for hired muscle there. Suppose you could always search Horson's house. Though I doubt you'll find him there. Maybe some clue, though. Okay. Um, where's the casino? Where's Junior's casino? Near the Temple Watch Towers. Horson's got nought to do with the casino officially. So careful what you say. Try not to arouse any suspicions. Okay, I'm not really feeling like gambling. Maybe let's search his house. Mentioned Horson's got a house. Where is it? Solid townhouse on Temple Isle, just on the other side of the bridge. Wouldn't wager me knickers on finding him there. Junior's not that stupid. Uh, that's fine, but I would like to steal all of his things. And the, the arena? arena? Sounds promising. Where's that? Sewers beneath Gildorf. But you'll have to enter through the bits. Endure the stench of poverty on the way. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm sure it now, smells bad, Junior but, like... Junior loves a good fight. It it doesn't Wait smell as bad as, like, see a real let's action. say you, you smell horrible. Like, look at you. Like, uh, you may have taken a bath, but I don't know. I think this guy looks like see he stinks. See if I can't Straight find up. at the casino All right. the arena. Might talk to Cleaver as well, though. Great. Do what you will. Just be cautious. Horson's expecting payback. I've no doubt. Yeah, well, he's gonna get it, Thanks probably. Thanks for help, Dijkstra. Just go, Witcher. And if you can't find the slimy bastard, come and see me. I know him well. Might figure something out. Okay, cool. Well, thanks for your help. Do you know what happened with Dandelion? Listen, Dandelion's missing. Any idea what might have happened to him? Same thing that happens to anyone who steps on Junior's toes. Meaning? 
He's surrounded by splendid virgins who ply him with sparkling wine and pastries stuffed with nightingale's tongues. Oh, yum. Come, Geralt, what do you think's <laughs> happened to him? I reckon he's at the bottom of the pontar, trussed up with the strings of his own mandolin. Okay, I will check there first. Look, far as I'm concerned, he might as well be rotting down there with a goddamn trombone. Wow. All right. Uh, do you have any beef with Dandelion? Why are you so irritable, dude? You seem a bit prickly. Something bothering you? Sorry. I know I've been unbearable lately. But at my age, the menopause, what with hot flushes <laughs> and violent mood swings. <laughs> Very Dijkstra, funny. Men don't get menopause. You know that, don't you? Yes, you moron. I also know you don't actually give a shite about my problems. What do you want? You got me. Need work. Thought you might throw some my way. Oh. Monster trouble, that sort of thing. All right, you yeah. got anything? Might be able to help me, in fact. And if you did, why then I might be inclined uh -huh. to ask after Gandalf. Okay, cool. Establish what happened to him. All right, well, you'll pay me on top of that, right? Ah, uh, nah, maybe I can help. Maybe what do you I need? Maybe I can help. What do you need? I'd rather show than tell. Picture's worth a thousand words and all that tribe. Ah, and you do realize, if you say anything about what you see here to anyone, it'll mean a razor between your lips. Yeah, haven't you failed Figured to kill me in the past, dude? Excellent. One last request. Oh, let's call it what it is. A command. Don't draw your sword unless I ask you what? to. What? I'm a witcher, man. My sword's like my big steel dick. I have to use it for everything. Is this a magic bathtub? Is that what I'm seeing? Oh, no. Oh, cool, dude. Wow, that's really neat, man. Oh, you've got a secret entrance to a secret lair. That's so cool. Be so kind as to follow me. Dude, I'm impressed. I gotta say, man. I am impressed. This is what I came for. This is why I come to your bathhouse and not some other rando bathhouse. Let's just drop down. Okay. Uh, all right. Great. What's down here? Yeah, yeah I know. You gotta... Ooh, look at this. I'm, I'm taking all this shit, dude. It's mine now. All right. That old goat hide, it's mine. All this water and, and iron ore... Dwarven alcohols. I'm taking them. Um, oh, Bart. Not again. Bart. What? What? Bart, stop that. Now. What the Bart, fuck? Man. Bart makes Ziggy lose, Jonathan. Beating your head against the wall won't change that. Bart, huh? Bart, less thinky. But less thinky, but sadness. Uh, uh, so where'd you get a troll? <laughs> where'd you get the troll? From Zerikania. Won him. Card game with a People are merchant. always fucking winning monsters from people See in card smiling. games. It's crazy. I'm dead serious. But I bumpy horses. Hot there. Ziggy Bart take. Good Ziggy. <laughs> Didn't I say that this guy looked like a troll too? I think I was totally right. Uh, so why'd you bring Don't me here? Don't have trouble communicating with the troll. Why'd you bring me down here? Take note of that hole. We'll come back to it later. Ah, you're digging for a heist of some kind, I'm sure of it. Vault behind it, until recently filled with Novigrad crowns and countless other valuables. But God, then boom, Jorfun go. Translating into common, someone fucking made off with nearly 20 tons of my gold and all the lighter stuff. And you will help me get oh, it back. Oh, okay. Uh, fine. Fine. I'll I'm in. Go. I'm taking You're a share, exactly though. You're bursting with enthusiasm. Witcher mutations. They strip us of emotion. I'd be jumping for joy otherwise. <laughs> Is All that right. true? No, I'm it's not around. true, because because Gary can love. Questions. I'm all ears. All right. Uh, thieves got in through Take this hole the thieves here. Thieves got in through the hole behind you. 
You're a regular fucking master. Smith. I'm the best, man. I'm Any the best. Any brilliant deductions you want confirmed? The year, maybe. Bloody name of Redania's king. Ah, uh, that'd be no, helpful. Let me I just get out my notepad. How that hole got there? Hole no. Boom. Hole. Bad look won't go. Bad look no. Only sleep. Bad shrooms head full. Oh, poisonous mushrooms in there? Uh, bad mushrooms? What do you mean? Bad mushrooms? What's that about? Pops mold. The spores are highly toxic. One whiff and you're dead. Unless you're a troll. Ah. Uh -huh. Yes. Bad. Bad troll. Yes, yeah, th thank, thank you, Bart. to you, Dimwit. Thank you. Where was I? Ah, mold spores. They cover the walls of the sewers other side of the vault. Actually thought it was a good thing, you know? A bit of extra protection. Thieves found a way through it. Bart, you see them? Bart, you hole. Want to see boom, got what? Breathe, shroom. Sleep, go. Oh my god, Bart. Well, kind of Gary, like, gone. you can, Bad we've got the story now, Gary, gone. you can just interrupt this guy. How now? Oh, Skip man. Okay, boom? Boom. Can you elaborate? Boom! Big. This line. <laughs> I'll elaborate. Explosion. Really? Big enough to blow that fucking hole in the wall, separating the vault from the sewers. Gotten pretty good at communicating with this troll. Lots of prior experience. Worked with idiots, my old <laughs> Touche. All right, have you tried to Try track, to track him down? down the thief yourself? Of course. Hired this lummox, Fonce. Thick enough not to ask questions. We knocked back some pops antidote and entered the sewers. Soon after, I returned alone. Oh, he what died happened? down there, huh? Lad started belching something horrendous. I mean, burps with so much mass, the walls shook. Told him, Fonz, stop. You're in the presence of a count. Well, former count, but still. And then he puked up. Up came most of the antidote. Lost his ah, I see. Tried to pull him out. Then I heard a bubbling. Something crawled out of the water. Whoa, cool. I value the lives of my men. I do. But I value my own even more. Dropped Fonz and ran like I hell. do have a, a, a contract for something in the sewers, so Should that's look good. the sewers. Got any more of that Pops antidote? Have a few vials left. Got the formula, too. Disgusting swill, to be honest. But it'll save your life. Awesome. Here. Thank you, man. All right. Thanks. You've not to thank me for, literally. You're no good to me if you suffer. That's me. true. Listen, I'll be upstairs if you need me. Sight of this empty vault's giving me an ulcer. Good luck to you. Okay, great. So, um, what I'm gonna need... Dandelion, Bart, what you're the just have you gotten yourself standing into? Uh, right... You, don't push me around, Bart. Um, okay, so I'm gonna have to take the antidote before I, uh, before I head in there. And I'm gonna have to, I mean, I have some, but I should probably make it, too, if I, if I'm capable. Um, so I'm going to do that, and I'm going to see... Holy shit. I'm going to see you next time on... Oh, I kind of blew it. Well, you know what? That's fine. I'm happy with what I did. What is this that I'm missing? Phosphorus? Okay, fair enough. Um, yeah, so we're going to do this next time on The Witcher 3. Thank you so much for watching. You know I appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you later. I'll see you around. I will see you next time. I can't wait to play more The Witcher 3, and I can't wait to do it with you. Have a great day. Bye.